Hi friends, good evening. Today it is 26 7 2022, and the time is 10 30. Sorry, uh, we had a webinar from 9 o'clock, so, so that's why you know it got delayed. And uh, the train change date has literally changed the train today, and uh, the winning uh, streak was a little bit disturbed today because of the train change date. And uh, today, our numbers, our timings, all that it rocked, and uh, Nifty closed exactly at our number 16,484 which was the cyclic date low, okay? Cyclic date low and today, Delta Corp, which was our weekly pick, uh, the RD stop loss is one rupee from 177 to 197 in two days time. Okay, it was a rocker. It was a literal rocker today. And uh, that was the pick which we decided on uh, weekly forecast. Uh, the video is also available. So you can go up and check uh, from 177 to 197. So uh, Nifty closed below uh, the weekly game changer number as well as the expiry game changer number. Bank Nifty closed below weekly bearish number and uh, it is holding weekly the expiry bearish number. I will show that you know, all in my PPT. And tomorrow we have six counters uh, uh, for uh, TCD and 27th is the mega, mega day for Koramandal because it is having... Uh, three dates in one day. Okay, three combination dates in one day. That is tomorrow. So watch out. Well, let's see how, you know, how, how much percentage is going to give tomorrow. In case, if there is no movement tomorrow, mark the high and low of tomorrow. That will give minimum 7% to 10%. Okay, let's let's watch. Uh, this is uh, in God's hands. Okay, so now let's go to the WhatsApp. Let's see what we discussed. And from there, we will take it on. Okay, so this is our WhatsApp group, and uh, this is the 907 number. Uh, today, uh, break below this, uh, it came up to roughly around this target, three targets today. And uh, the important combo time 1040 to 1045, only nine rupees stop loss. Only nine rupees stop loss, it gave roughly around 70 points. Okay, and we, we shorted uh, IGM. Uh, it gave roughly, uh, we started based on uh, one magic number, 359. Uh, it gave roughly around 9 rupees today. Okay. And Coromandel Delta Carp was a boom today. Okay. So, uh, future number worked very well. It gave uh, two targets today uh, after 9.30. And uh, the next uh, uh, make our break is roughly around, I think, 2 o'clock. Uh, Make our break. Where is it? Make our break. Uh, sorry, this was the webinar details. Uh, yeah, so this is a combo time. The combo time low also respected uh, the make our break candle. Yeah, the make our break is 25 to 210, and we gave this timing at 142. Yeah, let's go and see how market worked in all these timings uh, today. So let's go to Nifty. So this was our pivot number, 611, 16,611. Okay, so this was the pivot, pivot number for the week. Okay, so market opened here. This was our 907 bullish number, not even went near to that. So the candle started from here. Okay, 915. And it was a big candle. Came down all the way. This was the low. This was the bang on low, which was our first timing. Okay, and from there, it gave roughly around 70 points. Exactly this candle went and touched the fortune signals. Five minutes blue, and this is where we initiated our shot because we didn't hold any shot yesterday. We initiated shot at this candle, okay, because of fortune signals. I will show it to you uh, in the later part of the video. Okay, so from there, we started here. We started here, and we carried the positions home. And this is the number is 16,484 is the magical number. And today, Nifty close is 16,483.6, 40 paisa difference. Uh, anyway, uh, this close is below that, but the average closing was 16,484, precise number, precise number. Okay, so this is Nifty. Uh, okay, so I was doing webinar on how we, how you can capture Naveen floor. Now everybody is talking, you know, it made a rocket. This simple two number gave everything. And these two numbers are with you from, from the beginning of the month. From the beginning of the month. The stop loss is 
hardly hardly 20 rupees or 25 rupees for that it has given a gain of roughly around 700 rupees 700 rupees okay so this is the one magic number magic okay so that is why i was explaining the these things what we we discussed in the webinar today how to use this one magic number okay so now i will close this uh, anyway it has broken uh, the trend line so let's see what happens and it is within the channel let's see whether it is going to come and touch the channel this bank nifty let's see whether it is going to come and touch 35468 level uh, the levels you can go and uh, watch my ppt levels this is this is a levels which based on uh, uh, no, uh, the parallel uh, stuff i am giving and this is bank nifty and again nifty also exactly turned from the top okay so but for me these two is not much importance but this is what i am looking at now uh, maybe uh, the cup and handle pattern is forming or head and shoulder is forming. Uh, right, see whether it is going to give the right shoulder somewhere here. Okay, so it is forming that uh, pattern. So now let's go here. These are all uh, things. Now this is what is interesting to me. Okay, so now as I mentioned yesterday, day before on my weekly forecast, it closed exactly at the cloud. And the pitchfork resistance is on the top. And that is where it started the panic okay and it is inside the cloud now so now today was the very very important day again tomorrow based on astrologically bank nifty will have a major major trend change day tomorrow so watch out first 15 minutes high and low will do the magic because for bank nifty 26 27 and 28 all three days are very very important three days are very very important so watch out and uh, nifty is inside the cloud so let's see whether it is going to take the support from this pitchfork line or the breakout line which is here but till it is inside the cloud it is indecisiveness it is indecisiveness okay so this is nifty let's go to bank nifty again uh, the top was made exactly at the word number 36.993 and it is close to below the 200 day sma also but according to me it is close to below the pitchfork topmost line topmost line so that's what i said when when if it closes above this number then the targets are here here and even here but it is got restricted here so now it has to break this candle but it is still above the cloud so nothing to worry and uh, let's see how the lagging pan you know uh, do here whether it's going to give the m pattern or w pattern all that we need to see in the next two three days time so now in case if it comes down possibility of taking the support in this median line which is roughly around 36053 level let's see whether it's going to uh, do and yesterday i clearly mentioned that based on uh nifty future number uh which got converged yesterday i said minimum 150 points today i was expecting and nifty gave exactly 150 points today okay and i was expecting 500 points in bank nifty but bank nifty gave roughly around 350 points today so that's that's the power of that number when it got converged when it got converged and i've clearly mentioned why it is only you 150 points. I was expecting 250 points, but I said very clearly it is 150 points for today and it has given 150 points. You can go back and check my video. Okay, so uh, this is again uh, Bank Nifty. So nothing to worry on hourly stuff. Uh, leave that. All the numbers are already there with you uh, in my PPT. Okay, so now uh, let's go to Nifty based on Fortune Signals. Okay, so now okay, so gave a sell here on 25th it gave a sell it became genuine here it became genuine here at 16,630 came down all the way went and touched the blue gave the fake buy gave the fake buy it is not a genuine buy it's a trap this is a trap at 16,800 16,680 is the trap because it has given a buy but none of the candle closed above this candle this is where you need to go short this is where you need to go short. It's a fake buy where people get trapped. Okay. And from there today, it gave a, a big candle. I was waiting for the opportunity to go short at the blue and exactly it came and touched that blue. And this is where we went short. This is where we went short. Okay. And from there it is down. And in 15 minutes also, it has given a sell, but it is exactly at the one hour candle. So tomorrow is very, very crucial. Make or break for Bank Nifty and Nifty because both are sitting at 
the one hour candle. And the, this is the number which I gave us today. 16,477. 16,477 and the close is 16,484, which is our number, which was the cyclic date low. Okay. So this was the number. So I clearly mentioned these two are the price reversal zones. 16,477 to 16,441 in my PPT. And that is where it came untouched here. Yeah. And if you go to Bank Nifty, uh, the, uh, the one hour candle is way below, but it close little, uh, even in uh, one hour, it is still in bullish. And uh, this is Nifty spot, uh, more or less uh, the bottom is not given. But if you go to Nifty future, Bank Nifty future, watch this, Bank Nifty future, it has given a sell today at the closing candle. At the closing candle. If this candle low is not breached tomorrow, because it has given a sell. If this candle low is not breached, it will give a big U-turn. Big U-turn. If not, I'm expecting these two numbers, then this number and this number. And all this I've already given in my PPT. And this number is the must hold, 35919. I will show you why. Because this is futures, I will show you why. Okay, so Bank Nifty closed at a very, very crucial thing. And Nifty also closed at a one-hour basis on a, exactly at our number. Let's see how the market is going to plan out. And tomorrow, astrological event will have a major impact on Bank Nifty. On Bank Nifty. So watch out for that. And uh, we discussed all the six counters, uh, which is having the trend change date tomorrow in our webinar. I will go to the PPT and show that six counters so you can use your own technical analysis uh, to trade those counters. So if you go here, this was the number which we mentioned yesterday. Uh, price reversal zone. Where is it? Uh, this is 15 July, sorry. Okay, so... Yeah, price reversal zone is this for today. And exact the low was this. From, from the came here, it closed here. And this was the number, the first target after this. Okay, so Bank Nifty also exactly came here. That's where I, I gave a blue also yesterday. Okay, let's see tomorrow what's going to happen here. And till yesterday, the resistance was only one. But today, but today, there are more than five resistance. So now, whenever three numbers become bearish, you need to be very careful. You need to be very careful. So now, uh, let's go for tomorrow. Nifty exactly closed at this number which is 21st low, 21st low, okay? Bank Nifty is still holding, nothing to worry. So now Nifty closed and Bank Nifty closed below all this number, weekly bearish number, and Nifty closed below this number also, but Bank Nifty closed test here, okay? So Bank Nifty is still holding. So now again, uh, rest on pitchfork where we clearly mentioned it was an amazing tool to find the top and bottom. So the top was formed based on pitchfork analysis. And uh, again, today, bang on 150 points done based on uh, in Nifty, based on yesterday's prediction. And uh, trend is changed completely on the trend change date. Okay. And uh, whatever I discussed here, and mark the today's high and low, minimum 250 points in Nifty and 750 points in Bank Nifty below today's low or above today's high. And today, Delta Cut was the rocker, 177 to 196. If it close above 196, the next target is 225. And this is what I mentioned in my weekly forecast. You can buy this counter even with 5 rupees stop loss. If God is with you, you'll make even 120 rupees or 150 rupees. As of now, it has grown only 20 rupees. Let's see. But it has to close now above 196. Okay. So now uh, all this is already done. Uh, this I've already talked about. Watch out. Big make or break for Adani Group in August. And tomorrow, these six counters are having the TCD date. Coromandel, HTFC Life, Manapuram, Mukut Finance, Britannia, and Escorts. And we are particularly concentrating on Coromandel and Britannia because Britannia is having a second combination date. And tomorrow, Coromandel is having a mega, mega, mega date. So watch out for that. 
uh, mark uh, today is also a, a you know trend change date because this month it is having more than eight trend change dates coromandel so if the move is not big this month the next month it will be minimum 20% on the upside or 20% on the downside take it from me watch it okay so godrej property is very small uh, difference you can definitely uh, you know have a look we discuss all this in the webinar with the numbers and other stuff so this is tomorrow's number four number resistance four number resistance and these are the extension support which i have given here crucial number to watch out for bank nifty is 35191 and crucial number to watch out in nifty is 36464 and it is very near to that it closed so watch out for this number because this is a weekly number which it will not change for the whole week in nifty future in nifty future again i am keeping the numbers intact okay the price reversal zone is here break below 16441 on a 15 minutes basis only it is bearish okay till the time we can see some kind of a pullback if not gone for a toss okay so again here two numbers clearly bearish and two number clearly bearish okay and yesterday if you go here why i said 150 points why i said 150 points because yesterday uh this is for 20 surface sorry 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 so oh, sorry yeah uh, need to go back yeah because these two numbers are same yesterday if you go here you will see so when this merge you will see a minimum 150 points that's what i said in my yesterday's webinar no oh, sorry yesterday's forecast okay so when when things merge you will see explosion it may be on the upside or it may be on the downside okay so now uh, bank nifty two numbers so as of now the short initiated it is here let's watch and this is where it turned today this is where it turned today this was the pr is so let's watch how it is going to go and as of now based on uh, weekly pivot number both are in short and we are carrying our shorts okay and uh, that's all i have clearly given all the six counters for tomorrow and these are the counters for uh, friday saturday sun sunday saturday sunday not working so you need to watch this on monday so let's see how coromandel is going to behave how bank nifty is going to behave first 15 minutes high and low in bank nifty for tomorrow it's going to make a big a lot of difference in bank nifty tomorrow and day after this monthly expiry lot of gala time and 28 uh, bank nifty is again having a cyclic day thank god what what to say i don't know let's see we are going to see another 1000 points move from here on the downside or upside in the next two days time thanks a lot for seeing this video again saying i'm not a savvy real estate investment advisor so kindly do your homework or consult your financial advisors before taking any financial decisions thanks a lot see you soon tomorrow at 907 bye